Once, a king decided to hold a grand feast. It was a feast to be remembered and talked about. Attending such a grand feast was worth walking even a hundred miles. Everybody obviously flocked to the palace. Nobody wanted to miss the royal feast. It was indeed a grand feast for everyone. All kinds of dishes were served. All the courtiers vied with one another to catch the emperor's eyes. As usual, the king made a minister sit next to him. He enjoyed his company thoroughly as the minister entertained him. With his witty stories throughout the meal, after the meal, different fruits were served. The king and the minister conversed together while eating dates. While talking, they kept throwing the seeds of the dates under their chairs. Noticing the pile of seeds under the minister's chair, the king got an idea of having fun at the minister's expense. He slowly pushed his heap of seeds into that of the minister's with his foot. The minister did not notice the king doing this. Suddenly, pretending to be surprised, the king spoke aloud. Burball, I did not know you were so greedy. Is it wise to eat so many dates? There was a hush. Everybody stopped talking and turned to look at the minister. The minister looked under his chair and saw a huge heap of date seeds. And there was nothing under the king's chair. He understood it to be one of the king's pranks. The king was wondering as to how the minister would tackle this embarrassing situation. Unnerved, the minister turned towards the king and answered loud enough for everyone to hear. Your Majesty, I admit I am a greedy man. But I have eaten only the fruits, having thrown away the seeds. You have eaten the seeds along with the fruits. Now, it was the king's turn to get embarrassed. As usual, the minister had the last word. 